I, I keep forgetting. I keep forgetting to play the music, though. But, of course, I'm back with another really quick. Of course, I'll let Duck about a video. I, I just came back from... I see Duck about a video. Hello. Because I just came out of the shower. Oh, wait, out. I just got out of the shower. I just came from coming out of the shower. Because my face is super dry. I should have put on some lotion beforehand. <laughs> I feel like a deep baboon. But, of course, we got some brand new news for Global. This, be, this should be honestly pretty quick, though. Shouldn't take too, too long to cover and go over all the new stuff that just came out, though, of course. Because they do Gohan, New Piccolo. They are here for Global now. I kind of forgot to make a video for it. Because they just came out last night. It's like yesterday. And I honestly, I forgot. I forgot. I forgot. So, let's go ahead and get started, though. Like I said, I am a little bit behind on videos right now because internet's being really weird. I'm going to try to fix I think it's my driver's messing up for some odd reason. So, I'm going to try to get that fixed um, in the computer itself, though. So, I'm going to try to get that fixed up a little bit, though, because everything else is fine. It's just my internet connection being on and off. So, go try to get that fixed up. So, hopefully, the videos can get out on time. Hopefully, the videos, sorry if they're a little late. I'm trying my best right now. You guys know what I got. This video's out by now. I'll be cooking right now. But, yeah, of course, go ahead and get started, though, with Go Hunt Info. Like I said, I shouldn't take too too long to cover and go over. So we've got a brand new Duke Fest teaser, of course, for Gohan and Piccolo. There are brand new Duke Fest. They aren't too bad, though. They're not like, oh my god, the worst unit in the game. They actually were pretty good when they first came out. I think now they're still actually pretty decent. Like I said, probably not going to be running the team a lot, maybe, but I mean, hey, they're, they're still good enough, honestly. They're, they're pretty good. Of course, we got the banner and everything, of course. Uh, my units. Oh, they all loaded up. Perfect. Um, not too bad, though. Looks like he's still not too bad. Raditz, mm, him, eh. Yamcha, it's decent. You, eh. Like I said, the banner isn't good at all. I'm sorry to say it, though. Um, I feel like he might be aging now, maybe, but at the same time, this banner is not worth it. Not worth 4 stones, not worth any type of stone, honestly. The Vegeta and Nappa are actually pretty good themselves. Uh, they actually can use them, though, with the new Frieza team that just came out on JP. I like how we just got, you know, free Saiyan Saga stuff for Gold Boy, not in more kind of way before Dragon Ball stuff. It, it, yeah, because, I mean, the Bardock came out last year, so um, it makes sense because Frieza counterpart, of course, so. But like I said, nothing too crazy for the banner. Just skip it on it. So even the ticket version, it's not worth buying it. These, I'm not. I'm not. The banner just uh, sucks. So of course, we got some joint force packets. I uh, get some more. Get some cool drink items. We got some new. We got Zenny. Some equipment in there. Oh, additional nice. So it's the more you buy, the more you get. So Odakai, of course, for physical. Okay, more crit, more addition, more addition, no more additional. Okay, yeah, pretty much crit for um. Yeah, the new units and stuff like that, so it's not too, too bad. If you want to put them on there. So, I mean, that's free equipment right there. Technically free, but you just have to pay for it, though. But, I mean, like I said, there's so much equipment now in the game, so... Don't do waste too, too much time on that. Um, of course, we got the support, um... um a campaign, I always like to talk about this a little bit, because, um, that gives out more medals. So, pretty much, I guess, like, doing a category, doing it under a certain amount of turns, specific stuff, so... Not too bad, though. Of course, like I said, you just do these missions, of course, related to the event, so... Um, not too bad, though. Your Bond Master and Disciple team so it gives some extra medals for that it seems like yeah i didn't see anything else so there might be a little bit more missions though but not too bad though not too bad of course we got the new we got some new goats campaign stuff right here of course they've been updated so i think we just get more keys i believe it didn't change from the first original time i went over it which was rip hands or 18's event when they came out because yeah, all this stuff i remember but on the other hand like i said uh, this stuff is already here so yeah again this stuff was already pretty much here but yeah, they could just get more keys, I believe. I think originally with Dragon Stuff, but now it's just more keys. But yeah, the update update has been here for that though. So they have updated, so they probably keep it more keys and more little benefits and stuff like that though. But yeah, it looks like it's basically the same story keys. We get more stories, more like level stuff though, of course. Again, you just again, like I said, it's just more keys, which isn't too bad though. A lot of people do ask how to get keys, but I mean that's not too bad. That's free for global, so the slight little stuff though, of course. We got the new seven point five point seventeen point one update, which has a few new features. Of course, added power level bonuses. You get bonuses just from like you know your power level being up, like in the millions and billions, etc., etc. So you get more bonuses, like little character drops, some more zenny. Uh, this came out with JP for the anniversary, so global got that a lot early, which I'm glad. The anniversary is in July though, but yeah, I just listen up all the bonuses and stuff like that, of course. Depending on how your power level is, like I said, just like in potential notes gives you one point. Uh, now they've made it more clear, so yeah, him attention notes give you one point. The levels give you a thousand, which is crazy, which again makes sense requiring so much. Uh, clearing stages uh, gives you, like, difficulty, just the harder it is. You get more points from that, which is a lot in the game, Doken Awakening. So I assume this already reset, though, for this um, campaign, though, quick bug fixes and stuff like that, though. So it's not too, too bad right there. Now the craziest update, though, but it does help out. I mean, it is pretty, pretty good for what it can do. I'm not saying, because originally when I came out, I say, oh, it wasn't too bad. But honestly, it still isn't, though. Like I said, you're just getting power level. The more it's up, the more bonuses you get, though, from that, though. So if it's a pretty high, even grinding a lot like me, should be good. I'm way beyond that, buddy. <laughs> I'm way beyond that. 
and that too, because I'm always at rank 999, so that's really good though as well. So, like I said, this probably already reset pretty much, because it's going to get like your arts and pixel arts and stuff like that, but they tend to reset after pretty much almost, I want to say, every month or every celebration. I believe it's every month, so right now it should be renewed, so you can yeah, you go from level 1 to 12 for the missions again, so that should be back up already, since we already have this featured in the game already. Um, so that should be back up. The power level bonus campaign, which follows, I did see a few new stuff in here. Basically, until you get like more like EX, um, EX auras, like I get some more purple keys for free, which is really good. We've all been doing that a lot. The Guru event Rick level is perfect. That's really perfect. Time for EXP is back. That was already confirmed. Of course, stamina time's going down from five to, oh, oh, sure, not five hours. So I guess three to five hours or five to three. Of course, all uh, orbs events are up though. Baba shop 30% off. Not too bad. Not too bad. Um, but yeah, like I said, that's a W. That's good. I, I want to start ranking up more to more missions and stuff like that, of course, which is here. You're doing that guru event all the time. You have, like your dragon stones, which is really good. More uh, keys and global orbs medium. Not too bad, though. Not too bad. Again, the mission shouldn't be that hard. Like I said, it's probably just like based on the reason it's power level and getting it up and everything. So, like I said, because it's power level, cutting stages. So it's pretty easy there. Of course, Breakers got season five, which um, last season, you know, we got for the one year anniversary. We got a wallpaper. It'd be cool if they give us a wallpaper because we just got the season. This could be like a Goku Black Zamasu wallpaper. That art looks amazing, though, by the way. Of course, Fuse Zamasu in the background. I feel like they should have. Uh, no, because still, yeah, because season one had the. Um, you know, Oolong and Bulma, Frieza, Cell, like the first, like, wallpaper, kind of. Then, of course, we had this. We could have got wallpaper for this every time, because, you know, last season, we started the new one, the new one year, and, of course, now we got Broly and Gogeta. I guess I didn't want to spoil Goku Black, and, um, it was about which is, this should, this would have been perfect for Global if I released it. <laughs> it came out all the time, but, I mean, hey, I just took time to talk about it and go over it, though. Of course, all the mechanics, the game info, and everything. Lightbreaker's doing really good right now, also. That's good. The load times, the, um, crossplays, that was really, really good. I like that. Some more mission for the Joy Forces um, campaign uh, for uh, oh yeah up to seventy Dragon Stones, waking the Metal Shrine items. Okay, not bad. Just logging in every day. Of course, typical stuff. That just logging in every single day. This is the actual special mission to do in game. So, Purple Dragon Stones, Kai's, Sleepy Kai's, Dozy Kai's. Which they, they've been giving out those, those, those a lot. Oh, Toast Stones. Okay, not bad. That was not bad. Potential Orb, Pot and Parko Statues. Not too bad. Dozy Kai's, regular Kai's. Not too bad. Not too bad. Of course, go over the info, of course. I think I already know what's in here already, though. They don't tend to tend to go and JP stuff often, though. But let's still talk about it and go over it anyway, though. So, yeah. So, we got the bonus, push missions I just went over. The Duduk Fest banner I just went over. Uh, Dragon Forces packs, Dragonstone sale, like I said, on the 17th. That's when we're going to get Saiyan Day. Saiyan Day begins like on March 17th. The 16th, that's when we should get the data download slash info. Well, it should be V Jump. Data downloads, you know, info, full card art, full unit. And then, um,. I'm saying day on the 18th, so like I said, 17th, um, the 16th V jump, 17th actual saying day, that's when the info drops at 3 a.m. for JP and global. Then, of course, like on the 18th, that's when like it will probably like fully begin and everything. Like I said, they always change, they don't really change it up honestly, though. It's usually on the 17th, like right on the 17th, slash 18th. I think 17th is usually data download, um, unit info. No, they usually do like a live stream, usually like essay animations, card art. Um, then they leak it out on JP. No, they leak it on, on Global, you know, they do a Doka now, so I'm gonna get another one. Or a newsletter, honestly. It might be either or, honestly. I haven't seen Doka now in a minute, but... Well, no, no, no. No, no. no. Doka now or, like, a newsletter. We'll probably honestly see it there. Uh, whatever, whatever one they end up doing it, though, for, um, the 6th, 17th, uh, 16th. Of course, like I said, 17th, they actually like to be on the same day on time, so 3 a.m. We you know the 18th, um, with info and everything. Of course, the Doken Awaken missions, uh, the Doken Awaken support campaign missions, the new Doken Festival for Piccolo and Gohan. Card looks great. Here goes Big Buck challenges back there. You get a whole bunch of Zenny, which is really good, though, honestly. I got a lot of Zenny from that. A uh, Blind Master and Disciple on um, banner, um, support banner, Elder Kai banner, Dragonstone Cell. I just went over that already. Making sure. New Battlefield, 65th. Okay. 65th Battlefield is really good. Uh, just a better of the stage, new team battle for, um, with Nappa, which I heard that one did suck on JP when it came out. I think just like Kaioken Goku's and like Vegeta's. Honestly, that shouldn't be too bad though, honestly. Of course, Vegeta and Nappa getting an easy A, so I got easy A banner. Um, they actually brought pretty good though, honestly. Not too bad though. I mean, honestly, when they came out, didn't do that good. Gohan's getting, oh yeah, this, oh yeah, oh, oh yeah, I, I feel like he came out for Goldball already. Uh, of course, for the, um, the J campaign for Gohan. Oh no, he, no, he did come out with this. I'm thinking of Krillin. Have I ever done Krillin's at all? I haven't done I'm thinking of Krillin. Yeah, he came out for gold, but his as it came back yet. They usually bring one back with this, though, so they might bring back Krillin's. But I think I already have everybody ready for his campaign, so all I'm gonna do this video short when it kind of comes out with that for global, so that shouldn't be too, too bad. Um, 
but you nap is easy a do support memory which I think it's which one easy is from this one I can't remember I'll say I can't remember off the top of my head or a new one comes out of course cooler events are back the one billion fight one billion power warriors the cooler event from the down celebration mega freeze event King cold event Okay, LR Mega Freeze. Yeah, his campaign. He should be back though. So, so yeah, LR Freeze. Of course, his um, LR campaign events. Uh, no, it's LR um, event. Um, Little Slug movie, Androids, Cooler, and Goku. Okay, first Cooler movie, second so Cooler movie, and of course, um, for from Freeze's um event the back. Like I said, they got a, again villain counter counterpart LR for him to come back. So counterpart go on, etc. So I think do you have to use Gohan with them? I think you do. Like I said, I gotta look at that JP video somewhere around here. I'll, I'll find it somewhere. But yeah, pretty much I think for the campaign, like I said, not too bad though. We have a lot of good stuff here. A lot of good meat and its bones. A lot of good crazy stuff you can farm out. Grind, rank, Zenny, some dragon stuff if you want to go that far. A lot of good stuff here though. But yeah, we can think though, of course. I loved it all. I think it's all great. But yeah, um, pretty much everything I want to kind of cover and go over today. Pretty short video though. But yeah, see you guys later though. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. Great life. Hope you can make your way safe. Wash hands, cover all of you. Going up on where I'm at. So I'm told paper for each of you guys that can. Go ahead and grab some copium. Show up for some new shows for freaking wear guys are all awesome we can think of all this info of course i did again so i'm clicking keys i literally have like a feather necklace on right now and put some bracelets dragon bracelets but yeah oh uh, we got to think of all this info of course like you hate it again i juggle around when i do around this is fun but yeah we got to think of all this info though of course like you hate it again a lot of dragon stones a lot of stuff to get a lot of stuff to farm a lot of zany to get a lot of stuff to get at farm but yeah uh see you guys later though okay though peace out Bye. Uh -huh.